Lucas Media. So y'all know we've been having this gender battle going on for years now about uh, uh, men and women. And came across something that's very interesting online. I'm going to play the quick clip. I'm going to get my thoughts on it. Fair use. You know what it takes for someone like me to go out on a date? I got to get a babysitter for my kids. Okay. Should a nigga pay for that? Yes. Because that's what now. The kids that you made prior that's to me. That's what now. A part of me is my kids. And in order to take me out. You're making an investment for a relationship. So, and that's why. And, and, and I shouldn't have to pay for your trying. When you invest in I'm not saying company, every day. I'm saying. Okay. No, no day. Uh, unless no. we're in a relationship, that's when you can even feel like I should be adding on. I should be paying for even, stuff like that. A man but, that's for me, in no. my opinion. Yeah. They know that, okay, she's a mother of two. She's holding down a business. Wow. She's holding down a house. She's commuting from Jersey to New York. All right. How much is your babysitter? All right. So, let me get my opinion. And I want my sisters to, the, the, I want us to really have a conversation in the chat. But, I mean, here's my thing, right? Let's say hypothetically. If it was somebody I just met, then you're going to have to pay for the babysitter. I just met you. You know, we still get a chance to know each other. It might be the very first date. I mean, if you don't have a sitter that day, we can reschedule. But if it's somebody I know, even if I known them for like a year or whatever, and whatever, you know, then I might throw a couple dollars, but for a babysitter but why would i pay for a sitter and we just met you know i mean i got friends who have done that some very few far in between but the people i know who have has had some type of relationship with these people even if it wasn't physical it was still some type of relationship now the reason why you got to be cautious is because people will use people. A lot of times, you know, sisters be trying to use men just for a meal. Oh, I don't like him like that. I just want a free meal. You know? <laughs> so you got to, you know, I didn't mess around and gave a babysitter $100. You don't even like me like that. Then I didn't pay probably $100 for the meal. I'm down $200 and you don't even like me like that. You laughing about me in a text message. So, no, no, we get to know me, we get to know each other, and then, you know, if I feel that you like me and you don't have, uh, and I want us to go out a certain night and you can't because you don't have a sitter or you don't have the money, but you have a sitter, then I'll loan, or not loan, I'll help pay for it or we can go half or whatever. But if this is off the rip, we, I mean... We can just go another time. It ain't that deep. You know? Uh, and prime example, this is a long time ago. I went on a date with somebody, and they didn't really like me like that. They was just using me. We went to this restaurant, and the lady, the person I'm with, is a huge slab of ribs. She orders a huge slab, but I'm like, why? It ain't that, it ain't that you know, it's just me and you. She cuts the, the slab in half. Calls her son and says, I got us some food. So just imagine if she had, and her son was older at the time, but just imagine if she had a five-year-old and I done slid a hundred dollars and you cut the food in half and you wasn't even feeling me like that. You know, so now you gonna have to pay for it yourself, but that's just my opinion. I want y'all to let me know what y'all do in the chat below.